Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your Windows 11 power button shut down, sleep buttons are not working properly. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu, search for control panel. Best result should come back with control panel. So go ahead and open that up. Set your view by to large icons. And then you want to select power options on the left side. Select choose what the power button does on the top left. And then on the right side underneath power button settings, click inside the drop down. And you want to go ahead and set it to whatever you want. So if you want the power button to sleep or shut down your computer or turn off the display, you can make those selections there. So generally, usually if you pull down the power button, it just will shut down the computer. So that's what I'm going to set it to here. And then I'm going to select save change. Again, you're welcome to change it to whatever you like, but that's pretty much it. And if you're still having a problem, if you close out of here, you can open up the search menu again, type in CMD, best match to come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on it and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, type in SFC, followed by space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Go ahead and hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take a couple minutes to run, so please be patient. Okay, so once that's done, close out of here and restart your computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully that was able to resolve your problem. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. Do a buzz, it will help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.